What Should I Put on My Plate? by Kathy Torisi. What should I put on my plate? Table of Contents Food is Fuel, page 1 The Five Food Groups, page 2 The Fruit Group, page 4 The Vegetable Group, page 6 The Grains Group, page 8 the Protein Foods Group, page 10. The Dairy Group, page 12. Review, page 14. Index and Glossary, page 15. Food Facts, page 15. Food is my fuel. It gives me the energy I need to learn and play. If I eat the right foods, my body will stay strong and healthy. So what should I put on my plate? I eat foods from each of the five food groups every day to stay strong and healthy. When choosing what to put on your plate, keep these tips in mind. Enjoy your food, but don't eat too much. Have responsible sized portions. Fill half your plate with fruits and veggies. Avoid empty calories, foods that have a lot of fat, sugar, and salt, with little or no vitamins and nutrients. Make half of your grains whole grains, and choose lean proteins, and low or fat-free dairy foods or dairy substitutes. Let's look at the groups. Fruit group. Say it with me. Fruit group. Vegetable group. Say it with me. Vegetable group. Grains group. Say it. Grains group. Protein Foods Group. You say it. Protein Foods Group. Dairy Group. You say it. Dairy Group. This picture helps me remember how to build a healthy meal. Each colored section stands for a different food group. The picture shows how much of each food group that I should put on my plate. So let's look at it closely. Fruits and vegetables help fight diseases. They help your body to grow and heal. They are low in fat and full of fiber which helps you digest your food. That takes up half the plate. The fruit group. Different fruits have different vitamins and nutrients to keep my body healthy. To make sure that I get all the nutrients I need, I eat fruits in many sizes and colors, from tiny blueberries to huge pink and green watermelons. Fruit is sweet and healthy. I try to snack on fruits instead of other foods that contain too much salt, fat, or added sugar. Those things don't help my body stay strong and healthy. Fruit juice is part of the fruit group. Make sure the label says 100% juice. I can choose dried fruit or a delicious fruit smoothie. What, what other foods belong to the fruit group? Talk to your partner about that at home. What are some fruits that you might eat at home? 
What fruits do you plan to eat today? The vegetable group. Different vegetables have different vitamins and nutrients too. That's why I eat many kinds of vegetables. I like to try at least one new vegetable every week. Vegetables. When choosing grains, I look for the words whole grain on the label. Whole grains have more nutrients than other grains. At least half the grains I eat are whole grains. My breakfast cereal is made from grain. So is the bread in my sandwich and the tortilla that wraps up my burrito. What other foods belong to the grains group? Talk to your chat partner at home about that. Whole grains use the whole kernel of the grain. Refined grains go through a special process that removes part of the kernel. Foods made from refined grains last longer, but they are less nutritious. Choose 100% whole wheat bread, bagels, tortillas, and pasta. You can also eat brown rice instead of white rice. The protein foods group. Protein helps me build strong muscles. Meats like beef, chicken, and seafood have a lot of protein. You can get protein from other foods too. Beans, nuts, eggs, and soy products such as tofu are all great sources of protein. Eating a lot of animal fat that is found in many meats can lead to heart disease. Instead, choose lean, low-fat meats or alternative meat meats. Try to eat fish for protein two times per week. I like to choose meat that is lean. Lean meat does not have a lot of fat. Some hot dogs, hamburgers, and other kinds of meat have too much fat and salt. I try not to eat those very often. Meat, fish, eggs belong to the protein group. Nuts do too. So do hummus, beans, and tofu. What other foods belong to the protein group? Talk to someone at home about that. The dairy group. Dairy foods are made from milk. They are rich in calcium, which helps my teeth and bones stay strong. I choose low fat or fat free dairy products. They give me the calcium I need and they don't contain too much fat. Dairy foods include soy milk and foods made from milk. Foods made from milk that no longer have calcium in them, such as butter, cream, and cream cheese, don't count as healthy dairy choices. Ice cream has lots of calcium, but also lots of fat and sugar. Eat it only as a special treat. Some people can't eat foods made from milk. They can get the calcium that they need in other ways. Some soy milk contains plenty of calcium. You just need to check the label. Drinking milk with my meal gives me a serving of dairy. So does snacking on low-fat cheeses. What other foods belong to the dairy group. Talk to your chat partner at home about that.
I put the right foods on my plate today so I have plenty of energy to work and play. I will fill half my plate with fruits and vegetables. I will drink milk, almond milk or soy milk, and water instead of soda. At least half my grains are whole grains. I don't eat too much fat, sugar, or salt. Maybe you could make your own plate. Draw a picture of your plate for a meal today and share it.